Hello and happy day from the Pilates House headquarters. I decided to come in here today to film a little flow um, and I am using five pound weights and these little core sliders. Um, if you purchase these on Amazon, they can help you kind of recreate that carriage spring effect that you experience on your former. And I'm gonna show you how you can do a little plank series and some lunges with some hand weights to get that full body burn going like you do in class. So let's get started. All right, I got my two sliders. I'm gonna push them forward into the side. Um, actually, let's just go ahead and start with them. So weights are gonna come forward. I'm gonna take both feet onto these sliders, walk it back, bring my hands down onto the ground, and I'm gonna press it back into a plank position here, drawing those abdominals in, creating that long line from the crown of the head back through my heels. I'm gonna take a breath in. And then on my exhale, I'm gonna bend my knees and slide my knees forward underneath my hips, drawing those abdominals up and in, pushing my feet down into those sliders, and then I'm gonna inhale, lengthen back out. Elongating, exhale, pull. Nine. Inhale, lengthen back out. Exhale, pull. Eight. Stay lifted out of those shoulders. Inhale, lengthen back out. Seven. Six. I like to take it slow. The slower you go, the deeper you can exhale, the more you can draw up through those abdominals. That's five. You're gonna fill this in those quads too. Four more. Three. Staying lifted, two. Good, one more. Lengthening out. Exhale, pulling in. Inhale, take it back out. And then let's take those legs out wide. And then exhale, pull together, 10. Activating those inner thighs, stay lifted out of those shoulders. Nine, eight, seven, six. My abdominals are already getting warmed up. Five, four, three. Neck is long. Two more. One more. Good. Hold it here. Hold it here. Drop that right hip down, bend the knees, pull in for five. Four, cinching that right side of your waist. Three. Two. Notice I'm not doing 10, one more. Take it out, back through plank. Let's lower that left hip down. And when you're ready, pull five. Four. Three. Lengthening out is really important. Two. One more. Take it out. Step that right foot forward. Let's grab those weights and bring it on up. All right, can you see me? Now you can. We'll take that other slider. Set it off to the side for now. Left foot is on the slider. Weights in each hand. Let's start to take it back into that lunge. So I'm pushing back onto that slider through that left leg. Spine is nice and straight, allowing those weights to carry me down. And I'm gonna bring it back up, squeeze the glutes, slight tuck under at the top. Inhale to get up, down. Exhale, pull it up. All right, let's start to incorporate those arms. Inhale, taking it down. Exhale, bicep curl. Abdominals pull in. Let's reach those weights up. Control it back down. Take it back into that lunge. Push through that right foot. Zip those abdominals in. Squeeze those glutes. Good. All right, inhale as you lower. Exhale as you lift. Pulling under, this is six. Five. I'm getting strange looks through the windows. I'm like, who's out? Four. Three. And if you don't have a slider, I forgot to mention this, you can always use just a little hand towel and put it underneath um, your feet here. Totally fine. Two. One 
more. Reach through those weights. All right. If you've been in my classes, you probably know what's coming. We're taking it halfway into that lunge, and we're gonna hold it. Bend those elbows back behind you. Extend through those weights, extend through those arms, and then bend that left knee. Pull forward as you bend those elbows. Stay low in that right leg. Let's go for 10, nine, belly button pulls in, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, push through the pinky side of your hands, belly button back, three, two, squeeze the shoulder blades together and back, one more. Hold it back. Pulse up through the arms for 10, 9. Grabbing onto those weights. 8. Squeeze the shoulder blades together. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Oh, bring it all the way up. Let's take those weights down for a hot second. Bring them forward. Hands come onto the mat. We're going to slide that left leg back, bringing our right ankle on top of that left leg, and we're gonna go for some single leg pikes. You're gonna exhale, pull in, inhale, control it back out. Let's go for nine more, total of 10, nine. Scooping those abdominals up and in, and back, eight. Now you tell me if this is harder or easier on the floor rather than your reformer. Six more. And back. Five. Four. Three. Two. One more. Exhale, pike. Lift those hips, draw those abdominals in. Control it out. Right leg comes forward. Step it up. Ooh. All right. I'm in good shape after filming all these videos. Okay. Slider goes underneath that right leg. Let's hit that other side of lunges. Weights come into your hands. This is right. Okay. All right. Right leg goes back. We're going to lunge forward. Weights towards the ground. Push through that left leg. Squeeze the glutes to stand up and rise. Chin off the chest. Inhale, slow it down. Exhale. Eight more. We're gonna incorporate those arms. Even if you don't have weights, you can use water bottles for this little series. Inhale, lengthen as you lower. Exhale, pull up. Squeeze those glutes. Bicep curl, overhead press. Sun's turning up. Four more. Inhale, lengthen up. Lower it down. Exhale, rise, dragging that right leg forward. Three more. Slide that right leg in, sit a little bit lower. Exhale, push back, 10, nine. Belly button pulls in for eight, seven. Extend, six. Always thinking about getting longer, creating long lines through the body. Five, Woo. four, Navel pulls in for three, two, 
that gives long. One more. We're gonna take it back. We're gonna hold it. Little pulses up through the arms. 10, nine, ribs in. Eight, seven, lift. Six, get lower. Five, four, almost there. Three, two, and one. Woo. Bring it up. Let's set those weights down. All right, we got our little pike to plank flow. Coming at you, hands come down. Take it out into that pike or onto that plank. Left ankle comes right over that right ankle. Lengthen out, look forward. And then exhale, pike 10. Left ankle is resting on top of that right ankle. Here's nine. Eight. Lengthening out. Exhale, pull seven. And back out, six. into that plank. Left side comes forward. Rise up. Shake it out. All right. Let's say we do a little bit more. A tiny bit more here. I'm going to get into those arms a little bit. I'm going to take both sliders. I'm going to give get a little pad for my knees. knees onto this little pad. Let's make sure you can see me. Take it back a little bit more. All right, I got my sliders. I'm going to really regret this in a minute. All right, I'm going to keep both hands on the sliders, taking it out into a plank position. Modified plank, I should say. My knees are down. My um, wrists are directly underneath my shoulders. I'm gonna take that left elbow, and take that left elbow out wide, kind of like in a push up as I slide that right arm forward and pull back. And then right arm, elbow bends, left arm slides forward in a slight diagonal and push back. So I'm not going into that full push up. Soft bend through that elbow, shooting back and at a diagonal and pull it up. Inhale. Exhale, push, drive through those arms. Let's go for eight more. Eight. Inhale as we lower. Exhale as we lift. Seven. Pulling those abdominals in. Here's six. Five. Four. Three. Lengthening out through the neck. Pushing up. For two, one more, pushing it up, press it back into a child's pose, take a breath, all right, we're going to do a second set, this one's going to be a little bit more tricep focused, I'm going to turn to the side so you can see me here, and again, if you don't have sliders, just use a towel. They come onto a nice um, flat surface, not carpet, something where it's pretty solid. All right, let's go for a second set. Move these weights out of my way. Coming into that modified plank, pulling those abdominals in, tucking under slightly. Right hand stays directly underneath that right shoulder. Left arm goes forward as I lower into that half tricep push up and then press up. Inhale as you lower. Elbow goes back and into your ribs and push it up. Let's go for 10. And push. Belly button pulls in. Nine. Neck is long. It's not falling off the body. We've got eight. You really feel this in your core too. Seven. Sweating here. Six. Five. Four, three, two, last one, and pull it in, sit it back. Okay, roll it up, I'm gonna set 
is dripping over here. Okay, let's turn it onto our booties. Do a quick little bridge flow here. I'm gonna lay on my back. Feet are on the sliders, and we're gonna bridge it up. Inhale, exhale, squeeze the glutes to the top. 10, ribs are in nine. Eight, seven, squeeze the glutes, pull the ribs in, lengthening through the fingertips. Six, here's five, four, reaching those knees up and over for three, two, one more, and we'll hold it up at the top here. You're gonna extend that left leg out and pull it in. Whew. Just do the left side. You got nine. Position your heel on the center of that slider. Squeeze those glutes, tuck under as you pull in. Eight, seven, try to keep this left hip lifted. Six, ribs are pulling in. Five, four, three, two more. You got this, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, pull in, one more. Pull it in. Shift the weight to the left side, start to go with that right side, lengthening out, pulling in for 10. Squeezing that glute, push that slider down into the ground, drag it back to activate that hamstring. You've got eight, push through the arms. Seven, six more. Five, four, three, two, that glute tucking under one more ribs pull hold it here little pulses up ten nine squeezing both glutes eight seven six five reaching those knees forward four three two this booty works feeling really good so let's stick with it we're gonna go side to side squeeze that right glute and left glute ten nine ribs pull in eight seven six five Four, three, two, one more. We'll bring it back to center. We're gonna circle it out. Down and up to the right for 10. Pulling those abs in nine, eight. I'm shifting my weight from my right leg over to my left leg, tucking under in the middle. Six, five, four, three, two, one more. And we'll reverse 10, squeezing the glutes up. Nine. Shifting your weight, controlling that transfer of your weight. Seven, tucking under. Six, five, trying to keep those feet still on the sliders. Four, three, two, one more. Bring it back to your center, roll it down. This cold concrete feels so nice right now. Okay, we're gonna lengthen out those legs. So you're gonna bring it up. Oh, last little bit, let's do this. This is a test. Hands are gonna come to the outside of our hips. You're gonna push down into the ground. If you have blocks, you can use blocks here just so you have more space to move those hips. We're gonna take breath in. We're gonna exhale, lift those hips up, round under, pulling those abdominals in, coming into that C curve, and then inhale, press out into a reverse plank, opening through the front line of the body. Exhale, pull it in. 10. Inhale, lengthen, open. Here's nine. Inhale, eight. Seven. Opening up through the chest. We got six. Five. Here's four, three, two, one more. Inhale, open, exhale, pull, pull 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. All right, guys, I'm sweating. That was not easy, but it was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what your thoughts are about 
our new environment at Pilates House. And um, rest up and be well, be careful, take care of your friends and family, and make sure you move.